Hello, I am Kirby and this is our new game that we're gonna play, Subnautica Below Zero. The game is uh, available since about one year. It's still in early development and I've played it a few hours last year when it came out. And let's go. I've also played the first title which is only called Subnautica. Uh, they're both open world survival games where you can craft stuff, there's uh, enemies, there's stuff to collect and it has a really good story and yeah let's see what we're getting ourselves into the second game here below zero is obviously cold because it's so cold and the first game is only a normal in normal territory, average territory I'd say. And let's see. You sure you wanna go through the storm? You crash, we can't come back for you. I know. I need cover from that sentinel. We will enjoy our stay for sure, especially in those conditions. And yeah. Let's go to our first waypoint. Yeah, this uh, this planet is covered in snow, that's why it's called Below Zero. And uh, going the wrong way already. And the core of this game is that the planet is mostly underwater or covered in water. And here it's water and ice, obviously. So you can swim. And here we go. We should have. Oh no, we don't have. Okay. Let's see, we can pick those fish up. Um, if I press the right button for it. Yeah, as I said, I haven't played this game in a while. So... Okay. So bear with me. I've played a lot of other survival games. So pick up this. Left click then. Can we do this? Oh yeah, we can actually. And we need oxygen. Here's a life pot. Let's see what we have here. So, this is now our base where we can open the storage, and we have a lot of new blueprints that we can craft. Filtered water, for example, we can make with one of those fish we just got. And the first things we want to get are those O2 tanks and no, the very first thing we want is a scanner so we can scan our surroundings and then we want to go towards our survival gear here and yeah let's see we can can make water for now. Uh, actually, let's go for the fish. For the cooked fish, not the water. And then a 
Let's see, where's our inventory? Okay, and now we new creature discovered. Found a new fish. Can only cook this one. It's not special because the bladder fish is special because you can make water from it. Let's see if you can get another. Discovered. We can. The hoop fish. I think those you can also just eat and then you get a lot of uh, or a bit of water. I like this on the right side now. They show you what you can craft with all the stuff you have. So. We want to get some vines. So let's see if we can find some. Some vines to make the silicon rubber and the fiber mesh. Ribbon plant or that for the battery. Oh, there's already a snowstorm going on. Great. Here we have mushrooms. Oh, this is nothing, okay. That looked like something you can collect. Okay, I see there's no vines for now. Let's collect some stones then. Limestone. Um, there's different materials that can be in limestone and the other stones. So there's not one stone for everything. Oh, here's the ribbon plant, which is really good. We need that for something. Let's see what we need the ribbon plant for. It's actually for the battery, so we can make a battery. And with the battery we can make a scanner. So let's go back to the base to craft that. And then we can get started for real now. Because once you have the scanner you can... Here's some quartz. Once you have the scanner you can scan your surroundings and then you can progress a bit faster through the world. So let's make us a battery. And then let's craft us a scanner, which we will put into slot number one. The scanner now has charge as well, okay. That's also new. Before that you could just scan uh, as much as you wanted to, but now you actually have to check your battery. And then you just can scan everything and it tells you what's dangerous and what's not. Can we scan that as well? Yeah, we can. Okay, and those are the important parts. Here we got one out of three. Oh, yeah, up we go. One out of three uh, sea glider fragments, and as soon as we found three, we can actually craft the sea glider, or we see what we need to craft the sea glider. So that's our goal. In the near future. And those don't look very welcoming. Sea monkeys. Uh, they look new as well. I haven't seen those before. I hope he's not gonna hit us immediately. Looks like he will. Oxygen. Yes, we are at the 
the surface and the sea monkey still doesn't leave us alone. I'm a bit scared that he's gonna hit us. So let's just leave him for now. He's still behind us. But yeah, the big difference from this game to the first one is that you have more uh, that you have more ability or n not more ability but more incentive as well to go on land um, well what does he do oh my god he steals my stuff hello Okay, so he's not damaging, but he steals your shit. Okay. Oxygen. It's not really good. Well, it's annoying, to say the least. You have to swim after him. Oh well. Uh, let's see that we get some more of the plants, of the silica plants. to craft some more stuff. Copper. Copper is really good. We need that. And there's more of those rubber plants. So we should scan them actually. If you scan that, you also get more recipes for that plant. And you don't immediately die if you go to zero oxygen, but you start losing health. Oh wait, no, actually misinformation you will die but first you go you black out kinda so your screen goes black and you still have a little bit more time to reach the surface after your screen starts going black so let's cook those two fish so we have something to eat and with the bladder fish we will make water so we have something to drink and then let's see what we can craft. We can craft glass, we don't need that right now. We can make a locker, I don't think we need that either right now. So, we can make another battery, which we also don't need right now. We need fiber mesh and silicon rubber. That's the most important thing, yeah, because we need the survival knife would be nice. And the air bladder would be really good as well, but also we need silicon rubber. So, we should get, if we find creep vines, we are good for now. And as you also can see, um, there's day night cycles. That's not a stone, okay. And this looks really awesome here like the the lightning in the cave the lighting in the cave not lightning and you hear it there's a lot of other creatures as well here which I'm not too keen to find right now because we don't have any weapons or anything so let's try to not die here. That was really close. And let's look for some vines. This is looking promising here. Titanium and here we have creep vines finally. So let's see where the plants are. There's like sea. Oh, we need a knife to get the leaves. But there should also be seeds, creep vine seeds. And up we go again. At the beginning it's a bit tedious to always go up to get oxygen. But as soon as we have some creep vines we can, can get a bigger oxygen tank and then it's a bit easier. We can stay down longer. Also, if you have uh, 
if you have the fins you swim faster which helps as well and down here is something there's an oxygen plant nice can use that let's try it out take the oxygen okay it fills us up to full cool a graph trap fragment Propulsion cannon fragment. Yeah, there's a lot of uh, tech here. And the last sea glider fragment, which I really like to see. So that means as soon as we can find the parts, we can make a sea glider. And there's. Are those the monkeys again? Not sure. So let's see what we need for the sea glider. We need. Lubricant, which we I think we get off the vines as well. Copper wire, titanium and batteries. So we still need to find the the seeds here of the creep vine plants. And there's a flock of is that monkeys again. Oh, those are no monkeys. I hope they're not hostile. Oh, there's the... There's the seeds. That's what we need. Glows in the dark, so... Um, okay, we go up first so we don't die and then we grab this. Oh, we found the lubricant when we scanned that. Or we got the recipe for the lubricant but we can't cut these off as well oh we can't what what oh no 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 please no oh. where is he where's the monkey uh, wait, what that's what i'm not that's not what i wanted to do oh my god where did the monkey go though Well, that's really annoying. I got my scanner. So I think the best thing is, if the monkey is here, to not have anything equipped. And yeah, I think we just lost our scanner. So let's see if we can get some more of these. No. That doesn't sound good at all. And let's swim back to base. We can make another. Can make another scanner, I guess. Which is quite annoying, but n at least now we know. That we should be careful at night when there's uh, sea monkeys, so they don't steal our stuff. And yeah, also, every time you just swim to somewhere check if there's stuff you can collect on the way so you don't have to do it out of your way if you need something okay so let's see we can make some silicone now hopefully more than one yes so let's see what we want to, to build we want the o2 tank which we need fiber mesh so first of all we want the knife we can make a knife so we make the knife first, so with the knife we can then first of all protect us and um, yes let's get a bladder as well that helps for ascending in the water faster and the knife is really good because you can cut uh, vines, mushrooms and so on um, what do we need for this O2 tank? We need fiber mesh and we need more silicone for the fins. So let's get some more silicon and then we can make us some fins as well. And for the fiber mesh we need to cut cut the creep vines with our knife then. We can make copper wire, we can make lubricant and can we make a battery? That would be awesome. Copper wire we can make. Battery, let's make the battery first because we need that. Probably need two batteries but I think we should be fine. Now we have one copper too little. 
And let's make a lubricant and then we should have a sea glider already, if I'm not wrong. Yes, well that's awesome. Okay. And then, okay, we have more creep vines and we can make a locker, we don't need a locker for now. And let's, yeah, this is fine, the arrangement. And we still have two more creep vines. So, let's put some of that stuff into our locker. Actually, let's put everything into the locker except our food. And the creep vines. Okay, we should eat those. Well, it takes a bit of health because it's so old, I see. Okay. And then. Let's go for round number two. And now we can equip this and we're way faster than before. I hope the sea monkeys don't take... Don't take our... Our glider away from us. That would be really unfortunate. So let's collect some more seeds here. And then... Oh, we can't scan. I just wanted to scan this. And we should be able to, yeah. We can cut some creep vines. And here we can use the bladder, and we just activate it, and it pulls us to the surface really fast. And as you can see, every time we surface, it lags a bit. But, yeah. This game is still in early access, or alpha, probably not early access. And that's why. It's not always the best performance. Uh, let's drop the titanium and take the silver. If we can find it again. Here we could scan. This is the silver. Well, we don't have a scanner, so let's go back to our base again. Also, all these uh, devices have battery power. And as soon as it's empty, you have to make a new battery and swap it out. And let's make some more uh, ingredients. Silicone. Probably need a mo lot more silicone than we need lubricant. But let's make one more lubricant. Then more silicone. Just because it's easier to store the silicon than the creep vine seeds. Okay. Because the creep vine seeds take four and the silicons are way smaller. Let's put everything in there and I think we can make something else. We have the fins. Did we equip the fins? Did it auto equip? Yes, it auto equips the fins, which is nice. And we have one more new recipe that's lubricant we did that already and we should get another scanner so we need a battery and titanium can we make a battery we should be able to one more copper yes and do we have titanium that's a big question I hope we do otherwise we have to go out real quick uh, where is it we don't have titanium. So let's get one titanium quick. Titanium is the most common ore, so it shouldn't be that hard to find. There we have it. And then make our scanner again. So we're good to go. And yes, that's about it for today. And I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, like the video, subscribe to my channel for more. And see you next time. Thanks for watching.